animals and creatures that live in rivers. What are we going to do today? Today we're going to explore and learn about animals and creatures that live in rivers. What is a river and stream? A river is a natural pathway, normally fresh water, that flows to the sea or into another river. Sometimes rivers flow into the ground. Do you know these rivers in South Africa? This is the Vaal. This is the picture of the Orange River. And this is a picture of the Tugela River. Can you think of any other rivers in South Africa that you might know? Most of the waterways in South Africa are really streams. They may be mountain streams or upper foothill streams or lower foothill streams and then we get the lowland rivers. Our waterways, streams and rivers are very important for us to live. Water is needed to grow food. Energy is needed for food production. And water is needed to make hydroelectric power, as well as energy is needed to pump and move the water. We need to look after our water to save it and make sure we use it sparingly. What animals do we find in our rivers and streams? Well, fish, of course. Very many different types of freshwater fish. Have a look at some of these examples. Some live in schools. Some you see more by themselves. We also find insects and their larvae that live in and near rivers and streams. All sorts of different beetles, bugs, and dragonflies. Look how different they all are. Sometimes the water insects eat other bugs. Can you see this bug eating the other bug? Snails also live in the rivers and streams. Look at the orb snail with its round, curly, tight coiled shell. Then there is another one. Look at the spirals on it. Have you seen snails in the rivers near you? Frogs and reptiles also live in and around the streams and rivers. Here is a toad and a frog. Have you seen any frogs or toads? Their croaking sound is so beautiful. Have you heard that? Many different birds live around our rivers and streams. Look how different their beaks and bills are. Look how long their legs are so they can walk in the water. They eat water plants, bugs, frogs, insects and fish. Look at these different birds. See how their plumes and feathers are different to other birds. They all seem to have long beaks. Let's have some fun. Have you seen road signs with this little water symbol on it? That symbol illustrates the name of the river. When you drive on the road or walk down a road, have a look for the signs near the rivers or streams before you cross over the bridge. That's the name of the river. Here are some examples. Have you seen any signs like this? Next time you go out, Look for those signs. That's the name of the river or stream. Have fun.